Uh, one of the things I've learned to do on a boat is uh, cut hair. I'm now a freaking expert, whatever these things are. I actually have learned to use some scissors. This kind of gets it really short, so we try and keep it long. My uh, haircut of specialty is a faux hawk. That's the only one I do. Everything else I do, I ruin. I'm pretty proud of it. So one of the things I've learned is to trust my wife with my hair. She's <laughs> screwed up less and less. We hope you enjoy this video and don't forget to subscribe down below. We love your support, love your comments, and want to hear from you. Comment below, subscribe below. See you next week. Oh geez, shit. Ah. were great. We uh, visited Ray Roya where Katiki landed. That was pretty freaking cool. Each one has a pass. It's a very narrow opening which makes it really hard to enter these uh, except during daylight and at the right tide. On the flip side the passes offer some fantastic drift diving and by that we mean drop in on the outside of the pass and just rip through these. Sometimes they're like over five knots. We dove the passes at Ray Roya and Fakarava South Pass this way. It's like an endless strip of coral just kind of washing by in front of you. Sharks, manta rays. I remember that night. The sunny days are by. Fish galore, huge groupers. Let's talk about the groupers. A lot of these atolls have chiquatera. It's a paralytic poisoning. If you eat it as a human, you will also possibly get very, very sick. So as a result... There are the biggest groupers I've ever seen in my entire life. No one eats the groupers, man. They're like deadly. Goat. Hey. I never saw that movie living in front of the sea. I remember that night. I remember that night. Nothing around the fire. I couldn't feel much better. The sunny days are back. The sunny days are back. Fakarava South Pass and I think other places in the Tuamotu is the uh, grouper spawning. There's massive groupers everywhere. The sharks were eating them. It happens twice, June and July. And the next time it happened, we were in Toao. We just went snorkeling there and there was sharks eating groupers in half. There was the biggest groupers and the most groupers I've ever seen in my whole entire life. It was pretty amazing.
Nemo Tooth definitely has some of the most uh, unspoiled coral reef fish and just wildlife. It's just insane. <laughs> So we've been traipsing through the jungle for like an hour tonight. They set up all these traps right here, which is just a half open coconut. And these things are huge. But the butt is filled with butt juice. It's disgusting. It's disgusting. I dipped in it and then I got like the entrails. Sorry. I don't know, man. It's not quite the same. <laughs> You know, you can just command me to look left. I can turn my head. Turn left. There you go. You're a lot rougher than a formal hairstylist. Oh, really? <laughs>